Hello again. I help people connect to their divine truth and their divine wisdom through the animals. I find this is most easily done through safaris and other wildlife adventures. I have both coming up, Costa Rica and Kenya safari. So reach out to me if you'd like some more information. Today's question is, are safaris worth it? And all I have to say is, yes, absolutely, they're worth it. I thought the first time I went on safari, I was going to go, I was going to see animals, I was going to take pictures, I was going to come home and check another item off my bucket list, right? And that's not how it was at all. It was magical. And I can't explain the magic except that you need to go with an open mind and not have set expectations on everything and be open to how things are going to be revealed to you because you can't predict everything that's going to happen and you can't dictate what animals you're going to see at what park. We might expect to see certain animals at certain parks, but it's up to the animals. And really, all of life is unpredictable. Nature is unpredictable. You don't know when there's going to be a storm or, you know, something is going to come up that's going to change where you have to go. In fact, my first safari, we did have to change routes because there was rains and flooding at one of the locations that we had planned on going to. So we went somewhere else. So you need to stay open and flexible and it will be so worth it because There are experiences out there waiting. Once you get away from your home and away from your homeland and into a brand new experience, even if there were no animals involved, being out in the vast plains opens up your heart and your brain to an experience of possibility. It's so big and without limits. Okay, it really opens up the idea of no limits. There's no boundaries. And then you add these animals and these animals are living there, doing their thing. You don't know what they might do. It's completely unexpected. It's unplanned. It's unpredictable. And I believe we all need experiences like that in our life to help us set our own priorities, to help us know what is important in our life. Because what's important in their lives is going to help you determine what's important for your life. It's one of the reasons I like to take people on safari is you can become present with the animals in this vast experience and problems that were going on at home will no longer seem important. Perhaps your job, perhaps relationships, things that seem like they were your entire world you begin to realize they're not the most important thing. Tapping into that the unity of life, you begin to feel is important and how everything can adjust itself around that. So are African safaris worth it? I say yes. They're not that much money to provide an experience of a lifetime. They provide an experience that you can have nowhere else. You cannot see this in a zoo or in a safari park, anywhere else. There's only one place to experience it. And the experience is something that lives in you forever. That experience of being with the animals, of being in the presence of just the oneness of all. When you see a zebra walking or standing within pretty close proximity of a lion or a cheetah or a jaguar that is not hunting them, you realize that the zebra is not worried about it. They're not worried about it. There's a different time. They have a different understanding of how life works. And they're not living in fear or worry every moment that they're about to be attacked. Okay, like we might think if we are living in those moments where we see the predator, at all times, and we're worried about it. They're not worried about it. So when we're worried about it, we don't need to be worried about it all the time. All of the animals out there have much to teach us about how to live our life. So is it worth it? Absolutely. Absolutely. Visit me for more information, revcarencleveland.com, and enjoy your safari.